about UI progress view in UI kit by using storyboard. Welcome back. Let's talk about UI progress view in UI kit by using storyboard. So we're gonna create on this UI storyboards. So this is a view controller and this is a view controller. What is UI progress view? A view that this a view that depicts the progress of a task over time. A view that depicts that depicts the progress of a task over time. So first of all, we're gonna dry drop UI progress view on a view controller. We're gonna apply this UI progress view. We're gonna apply this constant horizontal vertical index and tenor and we're gonna apply this height and we're gonna, we're gonna apply this height and width and minus 10 and minus 10 width. I'm gonna apply this two constant minus 10 minus 10 and we're gonna apply this track tint color. Suppose this is the tint color is green color and we're gonna apply this track color. Track color is gonna be this pink color. Okay and we're gonna apply this track color and we're gonna apply this pink image and image we're gonna apply this image and we're gonna create this outlet ui view controller okay we're gonna get on this outlet ui progress view on a view controller progress view okay we're gonna get on this outlet on, on a view controller so first of all we're gonna get on this progress value suppose we can use set on this value bar progress value we can set on this 0, 0.0 we can set the initial value 0, 0.0 and we can set on this action so we're gonna get on this method at the rate objc func we're gonna apply the objc func and you can use the update progress update not update we can set on this setup pro progress set up progress and we're gonna create on this method setup progress okay and use the progress value however we can create a progress value so command z progress progress value and equal to progress value and is equal to progress value and is equal to progress value plus 0 0.01 plus 0 0.01 we can 0 0.01 is speed on this progress so we're gonna apply this progress task so self dot task we can use the progress view so progress view self dot progress view and dot progress in this matter dot progress and we can add on this equal to float initializers and add on this flat float and we're gonna assign on this float value this is a float value is progress value okay we're gonna bind on this property progress value and we can set on this conditions if condition we're gonna get on this condition so progress value progress value and not equal to not equal to we're gonna send the 1.0 this is a initial value is 0 0.0 and largest value is 1.0 so we can self dot perform we can use the progress method that plot perform perform and you can set on this initializer perform with and after delay with and after delay we can set the hash selector method so this is the hash selector and you can set to set up progress and update progress in the setup in the setup progress methods set up progress and with we can use of with with the assign on this support this is the nil dot nil we can assign on this dot nil and we can have the time interval time interval you can set on this time to 0 0.2 second to suppose we have 0 0.4 second not applying this 0 0.2 this is a 4 second and we're gonna add on this perform view did dot method so self dot perform and we can set on this hash selector when with after delay hash selector and with after delay and you can use of hash selector and you can use of setup progress and we can use of nil on this width and we can use the after delay 0 0.4 we can send the after delay 0 0.4 okay we're gonna run on this progress view this is initial view controller so progress view a view that depicts the process of a task over time so we're gonna running on this project okay we can running on this project this is a progress view initiate on this process we can set on this initial value we can 0 0.4 second at after delay times 
and you can expand on this progress view Pro progress view have a time for 0 0.4 second 4 point 0 0.4 second you can apply the progress view time you can set on this suppose progress time 0 0.1 and we're gonna change on this color suppose which have change of managed to report and this progress view you can send on the tint color suppose this is a tint color is pink and we're gonna send on the extract color is clear color we're gonna run on this project okay we're gonna run on 0 0.1 second on this 0 0.1 second this we can largest speed on this progress view we're gonna run this largest speed on this progress view you can use a progress view largest speed suppose we can change on this color suppose 